next exercise uh, choice B give the first step you will use to separate the variable and solve the equation okay so again they're asking giving the first step so it's easy one see the first question x minus 2 equals 0 so give the first step so that means x minus 2 you put here plus 2 if it's minus 2 you put plus 2 equal to 0 you write here also plus 2 so these two cancel x equal to 2 understood and see the second one x plus 3 equal to 0 so we can write here x plus 3 means we'll put here minus 3 and here also minus 3 so these two will cancel x equal to minus 3 okay and see the third one x minus 5 equal to 3 that means x minus 5 we'll write here plus 5 and here is also plus 5 what we are writing same we'll write here so x these two will cancel 3 plus 5 is 8 understood and one more we'll do fourth one x plus 7 equal to 5 so we can write here x plus 7 minus 7 and 5 minus 7 so these two will cancel x equal to 5 minus 7 is minus 2 okay next question number two question number two is what's given here give the first step you will use to separate the variable and then solve the equation okay so question number two see the first question 2t equal to 34 so this is 2 into t equal 34 so what you have to do here if it's like that means you divide by 2 and here also divide by 2 okay so 2 to cancel t equal to 2 how many times in 34 2 17 times okay and see the next one x by 3 equal to 7 so this division is here so what you will do you will multiply 7 into 3 so 3 3 cancel x equal to 7 3 0 21 and the third one 5y equal to 26 so that means here is multiplication so we have to divide so divide by 5 equal to 26 by 5 so if 5 I cancel so y equal to 26 by 5 okay we can just give another means you otherwise you can divide it also okay 26 divided by 5 is 0 25 remain 1 so quotient remainder by divider we can still give only this much means just keep it like that okay now question number three uh, give the steps you will use to separate the variable and solve the equation okay so 6x plus 2 equal to 11 question number three 6x plus 2 equal to 11 so what you're doing here 6x plus 2 will put here minus 2 minus 2 okay so we are doing subtracting 2 okay to here so now these two will cancel 6x equal to 11 minus 2 is 9 okay again what we'll do now now we have to divide by 6 okay so dividing by 6 so this 6 6 cancel x equal to 9 by 6 we can cut 2 3 0 3 3 0 so answer is 3 by 2 so that's over now we'll go to the second question now question number 3 uh, second one 5y minus 7 equal to 3 okay so here what we'll do you see 5y minus 7 okay so here minus means we'll put here plus 7 plus 7 so that means what you're doing adding both side by 7 adding both side by 7 so these two will cancel so 5y equal to 3 plus 7 is 10 so what we'll do now again divide okay dividing both side by 5 you can write here dividing both side by 5 so 5 5 will cancel 5 how many times in 10 5 2 are so y equal to 2 okay now we'll go to question number third one question number three is was given the third one uh, 10 p by 3 equal to 20 okay so what we can do here 10 by 3 will multiply by here 3 and here also you multiply by 3 so what we'll write here multiply 
both side multiplying both side by 3 okay you can write multiplying both side by 3 so this 3 3 cancel 10 p equal to 20 into 3 is 60 okay so therefore what we'll do again next line we'll divide by 10 divide by 10 okay so we'll write here dividing dividing both side by 10 so what we'll do here so if you divide it 10 10 cancel so p equal to here 0 0 cancel so answer is only 6 therefore p equal to 6 okay